and welcome to the British Fencing Monitoring and Evaluation Tool Tutorial Videos. In this series of videos, we will run you through the m &E tool and how to use its different features. In this section, we will cover how to add sessions to participant data. We'll start off by logging in and choosing our organisation and coming through to our project. Once we've selected our project, we will scroll down and we've already entered the participants in this case. So we can see all the participant data is added to this project and all we need to do now is start adding sessions. So we go over to the numbered columns, each number represents the session and we can tick the sessions that that participant has attended. Once we've added in some sessions for that participant, we will remember to click save so the data is not lost. And then the data for those two participants is now stored. We can see that that data has now been uh, correctly recorded. So we can go back into the project and start adding more data for the other participants. And once we start to fill up these sessions so that we have a good full list of project attendance here for the eight participants that have taken part in this particular project. And once we're happy that we've entered all the data correctly, we must remember to click save to store that in. And now we can scroll down and see that all the data is correctly entered and all the sessions are completed. That concludes our tutorial for adding sessions to the m and &E tool. Thank you for watching the tutorial guide to the British Fencing m and &E tool. Please do check out other videos in this series for more details of how to use the features of the m and &E tool. If anything is unclear, or if you need further assistance with things not covered in these tutorial guides, please do get in touch with your British Fencing contact.